These are the stacks of cassettes from a single hive, full season, using a two queen system. The covers are added to each cassette while still on the stack. First, strip down the tapes and install a cover by engaging one corner first and then pivoting into place. This diagonal ribbon label was designed for the half comb cassette. Finally, pry the covered cassette off and clean the bottom as needed while transferring to a new stack of interlocking covered cassettes. Note that this is the first time each cassette is handled individually. The hallmark of honey in the half comb, exclusive to the half comb, is the clear view into the miracle of natural honeycomb. The uncommon marketing appeal is due to this clear view, which shows natural honeycomb just as stored here by the bees. A display like this is unrivaled. When those with no knowledge of comb honey see this natural honeycomb and realize that it is untouched by human hands, they are immediately enlightened and fascinated. The upward sloping cells, as they are on the hive, are less likely to leak honey from unsealed cells on the shelf. The cassette is its own server. Honey is taken from the cassette directly. There is no need to transfer honey to another dish. A strip of clear tape on one edge of the cover serves as a cover hinge to protect honey between servings. In stacks, with back on lighting, the display of honeycomb is especially conspicuous. The producer's label or flyer can be placed on the bottom and the covers sealed with a short piece of tape. They cannot leak. The same can be arranged in groups on edge with cells sloping up. The one-sided comb with deep cells have no midrib of comb foundation. The wax content in the half comb is less than in conventional honeycomb. The diagonal ribbon label makes the display of cassettes even more eye-catching. Producing comb honey like this is an art, an art well worth mastering. The unique properties of honey in the half comb support pricing at a premium in general, but especially in the lucrative natural food and gift markets. This, combined with the major labor savings built into the cost of the cassettes, has value received, and where time is money, dwarfs any modest extra cost of cassettes. Overall, the half comb system is the most cost effective. This new form of comb honey could also be the foundation for a new visual strategy to restore the lost awareness of comb honey. Now this is the, I'm looking at the bottom hive now. 
like you say, it's about ready to come off, but I'm going to raise it up and put the new ones under it and let them finish. I think there's some real top honey in that super there.